New York City effectively has been shut down. All tunnels in and out of the city have been closed for security reasons. The airports are closed. The subways are closed. Traffic has been removed from the streets. All hospitals are on extra alert. One right kind of uh, in the middle of it all at ground zero is St. Vincent's Hospital. And NBC's Robert Bazell is there as he has been all morning. Robert, any additional word on casualties? Well, uh, Tom, actually there have been about 200 casualties, some of them very severe, uh, uh, at least eight deaths, and five of those were firefighters or policemen. We're not sure of which, which one. But one of the things that's amazing about being here is that it has been much slower than anyone anticipated. There ha that's a lot of casualties, of course, and it's, uh, but the casualties have been coming out of lower Manhattan at a much slower speed than people anticipated. I think just because the, as one rescue worker who had been down there told me, it's just hell down there. You can't move around. You can't uh, discern who's what, a body part from a living human being in, in several of the areas. So we have a very dedicated staff standing by. Large numbers of medical workers are ready to uh, attend to anybody who appears. Bob. Several have been very severely injured, but we're still waiting.